Jamie, I'm sorry. I was supposed to ship this package out to you yesterday. I was at the post office. They uh, said you're in a rural area. They say that's where I am. And uh, so mail always takes one extra day to get to me. It doesn't seem rural at all. So I got me a post office box in another city so I can get overnight shipping. But they were charging me, wanted to charge me $88 to get it to you in two days or $33 to get it to you Thursday. And of course I'd be mailing it Monday. So that just was a long time in mail. I only have 48 hour heating packs. I'm going to show you how well packed I have this fish. Um, if anyone else sees this film, this is, I was mailing this to a gal named Jamie in um, North Bend, Oregon. And uh, we just got 37 degree temperatures. It has been worse than that, but this is the warmest it's been in a while, so I thought it was the opportunity to send it. So let's take a look. I've got this thing packed. I mean, like an Eskimo. Some of my friends think it still would have made it because of how well packed it is, but. Uh, I didn't want to take the chance of sending it for $33, taking nearly four days to get there, and running out of internal heat after only 48 hours. But some of the people I talk to think as well as I've got it packed, it would have survived. I have my doubts. Uh, I just don't know. Um, I have... Uh, uh, oxygen in the bag, so you know it, it's it was packed to last a while. It probably could have gone, but it was a gamble. I want you to see how well packed this baby is, though. I'm telling you. So here I have an internal packaging now going on, and everything's been rebagged again. So we cut open the first box. There's two boxes in here. I was trying to make sure it could really. Uh, you know, weather the shipping. I wasn't expecting to run into a uh, four day shipping period. So here we got insulation that's bad, special insulation. So it's going to be really warm. And then another internal package. I had 48 hour heat packs in here all the way around just to make sure it stayed warm inside the internal one. So, then we go inside the next box. We'll just take it out. So, you see that uh, insulated box? That was, I'm telling you, I, I really had plans on uh, making this thing work. But I figured I need to talk it over with Jamie and uh, see. I, can't imagine they want to buy one fish and pay all that shipping. Yeah, that's too much. I'm not charging for the packaging. So it's well packed. A lot of money to pack something like this, but I wasn't going to charge anything for that. You know, I was going to let them pay for the actual shipping. So you see again another internal bag. More styrofoam. Well, it has been shipped, you know, packed well. Then I have uh, heat packs, double, inside an egg carton. So, uh, then we have the fish. And I got it in a cloth bag. This thing has been bagged four times. You see the uh, duct tape internal bag. So I packed this baby to really take some abuse. But I'm afraid uh, 
between the postage and the Oregon weather, I'm afraid it was going to dish out quite a bit of abuse. I just wasn't sure about, wasn't sure about all that. So I'm making this tape to send to Jamie to explain why I didn't ship it yesterday. had a small leak but it couldn't go anywhere with all the quadruple bagging. And there's my fish in there good and alive. I'll pull them out. Let Jamie look at them. So this was going to be the uh, Severum I was going to send you. Let's see if I can pick it up on the camera. If you can see, yeah, there we go. The light's not working for me. Let's see if I can get a light on this. All right. So that's the Severum I'm trying to send Jamie at a really good deal. But I just didn't dare do it under these conditions. I need a longer... I'm sorry. I just needed a longer air pack or heat pack in there. And... Uh, I wasn't prepared for a four-day shipping deal to you, Jamie. So I'm going to float this back in the tank, and uh, we'll talk and see what we want to do. It may be better just to try to find something locally. My apologies. I had good intentions. Uh, take care, Jamie. I'll be hollering back at you soon.